Hey everyone, I'm Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you what to do if the safely remove hardware icon disappeared in Windows 11. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to create a safely remove hardware shortcut. To do this press the Windows plus R key combo to open a new run window and then make sure to copy paste the following command that I posted in the description below. Now simply press on OK and as you can see this will open the safely remove hardware dialog. And from this dialog you can select the device you want to remove and remove it by clicking on the stop button. So if you want to create a shortcut make sure to right click on an empty space on your desktop, hover over new and then simply click on the shortcut option. Now in here in the type the location of the item box make sure to copy paste again the same following command from the description below and then simply press on the next button. You can name this shortcut safely removed hardware. Now just press on finish and as you can see the icon is now on your desktop. Now if you double click on it you will see the same list as previously. In here you can stop any hardware that you want to disconnect. Moving on another useful solution is to simply change your notification settings. First of all make sure to connect some hardware to your PC like a USB stick. Now simply click on the arrow in the bottom right to expand the sysbar section then locate the safely remove hardware icon and simply drag it to your taskbar. And as you can see the icon should now be pinned to your taskbar and visible whenever you insert a removable media. Moving on another useful solution is to simply reinstall your devices. To do this right click the windows button then select device manager from the list of options. Now in here in the device manager window make sure to click on the view tab and first of all select the show hidden devices option. The next thing you have to do is scroll way down until you find the universal serial bus controllers and expand it. Now the next thing you have to do is simply locate the universal composite devices or serial bus controllers, right click on them and select the uninstall device option. Confirm again by pressing on uninstall. Keep in mind that you might have to uninstall all devices in this section before you can fix the problem. So make sure to close this window afterwards, restart your computer and you'll see that all the devices will be automatically reinstalled. You can then check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to simply restart Windows Explorer. To do this right click on the Windows button then select Task Manager from the list of options. Now in here simply locate Windows Explorer, right click on it and simply select the end task option. Afterwards you'll see that the screen might get blank because Windows Explorer will reinitialize, so don't lose patience or get scared. This is super normal and then everything will be back on track. You can then check if the problem still persists. And lastly another useful solution is to check if the plug and play service is running properly. To do this press the windows button then type in services.msc and select it as an application from the search results. Now in here scroll down until you find the plug and play service then make sure to double click on it to open its properties window. Now you should just check the service status. If it's not running make sure to click on the start button to start the service. In the same time some users are also suggesting to change the startup type from manual to automatic. You can then press on apply and ok to save the changes. However, as an alternative we highly recommend you to try out Restoro, which is an app that specializes in scanning and repairing any issues with your Windows operating system faster than you think. At the same time Restoro also repairs damage caused by malware which is a great plus in functionality. So make sure to check out the link in the description below. And that's it, plenty of solutions to consider. As usual, for more information and details you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.